Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to show you uh, one of the amazing projects I have developed. Uh, see, I want to show you this project because many people are asking me sir, how we can integrate the artificial intelligence with these kinds of real world project development. Okay, so I think you already know that uh, personally I'm from electronics background. I used to work in the robotics field. So still I'm exploring robotics because I love to work with uh, these kinds of hardware. And this is my small lab, you can see. Uh, it's like a little bit random uh, but uh, uh, it's been long actually I've been working on the project so finally it's running so see this is uh, like a uh, automatic robotics arm I have uh, developed so uh, here I'm trying to like uh, do one industrial automation so this kinds of uh, like project is already available over the market but this is the POC kinds of things I have developed I want to just show you how uh, you can integrate actually different different like technology like computer vision generative AI okay with this kinds of real world uh, product development so see this is like a automation uh, arm okay robotics arm so what it can perform exactly so here we are having let's say different different cubes as you can see we are having different different colors like green then yellow then we are having red okay and on the other hand, we are also having some QR code uh, cube, as you can see. So this is a QR code. This is another uh, like pattern QR code, and this is another one. So what this arm will do? Uh, it will first of all. Uh, so these are the cube actually. Will go through this conveyor belt, and here is a camera. So if you can focus here, okay, you can see here is a camera. So this camera will try to analyze the cube. Okay, that means the color. So let's say here I am sending. Okay. Here I am sending the red color cube. Okay, so here as you can see, this uh, cube has stopped here. So now camera is analyzing the entire uh, picture, like what kinds of object it is. Based on that, it will again, okay, uh, run that conveyor belt, and it will come here and it will stop here. You can see. Okay, so here I am using IR sensor. Now my arms will move. Okay, it will pick up that uh, cube. Okay, and it will try to keep that cube in the respective container. So here we will try to create a red container. Inside that, it will give that particular cube. Okay. Now let's say I'm having another color, which is uh, yellow. Now if I pass it here, okay. Now again, you will see that it will stop there. Okay. And camera is analyzing. So here is the code. You can see real time it is running. You just uh, take that. Okay. Now again, it is uh, uh, throwing that cube to the conveyor belt. Now it will stop here and again my arm will move and it will pick that object and it will hit okay in the respective uh, box all right now let's say here i have a green one okay now let me show you this green also see now real time you can see the detection part okay so see i can also like uh, deploy these kinds of uh, ai model to the edge devices also because in my YouTube channel, in my many video, I have already talked about that. Now I'm showing you everything in real time. And now see, again, uh, it will pick that object. See. And it will keep in the respective box. Okay, so here I'll be keeping three boxes. Okay, three boxes I'll keep. Uh, red, uh, yellow, and green. Now let's try to do it with my QR code cube, okay? Now let's say this is uh, one of the QR code here. If I pass it. So see, real time, it is analyzing the QR code, you can see, okay, and you can see it is showing my name because I converted my name as a QR code, and now it will uh, again go, stop here, now it will pick that QR code and it will keep it in the other respective box, see, okay. Now let me show you another example. So let's say this is another cube, uh, QR code I'm having. See real time, it is analyzing. Okay, now it will pick up. I'll pass it otherwise. Okay. Now, so I think you have already got it. So I have another one. So I'm not going to show it. I think you already got it. Okay, how things are working. Now, uh, here is the entire development, as you can see. Okay. 
So here uh, I have already written all the codes, like how we are uh, doing this kinds of real-time detections, how we are analyzing the entire image. With respect to that, we are uh, sending the signals to the hardware, okay? And hardware is doing all kinds of jobs, okay? Now, I think guys, uh, you got it. Uh, why in my video I always tell, there are lots of fields you can apply this kinds of AI, okay? GNI, computer vision, whatever you are learning. Only just need to get the idea, okay? How I can deploy these kinds of, let's say, technology to different, different kinds of products. So, uh, this is my YouTube channel, I think you already know that. Uh, so here I already teach uh, different different technology like computer vision, JNAI, okay, uh, then uh, deep learning. So soon I'm going to start uh, a dedicated computer vision playlist. It will be completely free. So there I'm going to show you this kinds of real time object detection image analysis, okay. So that you can also develop these kinds of projects, okay. And again, this is one of my uh, simple and uh, small like uh, lab, okay. Uh, whenever I get time, I usually uh, come here and I try to do different, uh, different different innovations okay and i try to come up with different different idea so guys uh, you can uh, start following my channel so here soon i'm going to uh, start that playlist okay then i'm going to cover each and everything related computer vision you need to know even i'm going to also show you how you can use generative AI, okay for this kind of amazing implementation with that guys i think you have liked uh, the entire like set up the entire projects okay uh, and uh, always remember uh, whatever you have learned, uh, learned okay so far just try to get some idea and try to okay do practical as much as you can uh, so definitely you will be able to also build these kinds of projects with that guys thank you so much uh, for watching this video and i will see you next time